Life Living and Fiercely Empowered, take 269. Today's topic, destiny, owning it. I'm here at Fifth Avenue and 14th Street on my way to visit a friend to encourage and to uh, empower each other to make 2016 phenomenal. Listen to this note I got from the universe. It is so tempting, Blaine, to look at your present life situation, at whom you're with, at where you work, at what you have and have not, and think to yourself, this is obviously meant to be. I'm here for a reason. And to a degree, you'd be right. But you are where you are because of the thoughts you used and may still think. And so, you are where you are to learn that this is how life works, not because it's meant to be. Don't give away your power to vague, mysterious logic. Tomorrow is a blank slate in terms of people, work, and play because it, too, will be of your making. You will again have that sense that it was meant to be no matter who you are, who are, what you've drawn into your life. Nothing is meant to be. Blame, except for your freedom to choose and your power to create. Ungawa, the universe. And I leave you with the words of Jean de la Fontaine. A person often meets his destiny on the road he took to avoid it. Life, living it fiercely in power.